Team Fever back again with another video, and I'm back with another Watch Wrestling with Me video. And in this Watch Wrestling with Me, we will be watching Adam Cole versus Dalton Castle, Ring of Honor, Death Before, ooh, Death Before Dishonor 2015. Okay, so we're watching something from a pay per view. And I just say, I love Death Before Dishonor, it's got to be one of my favorite names for a pay per view. Just say it out loud and tell me it does not sound badass. Death Before Dishonor. That is like a tattoo. I, I love that. Death Before Dishonor. Just say it out loud. Are you watching this, say Death Before Dishonor out loud. That is the best name for a pay-per-view, period. Period, to me. But, i never seen this. I'm excited to watch this with y'all. Let's watch it. I never liked Dalton Castle. All right, I started watching. Well, when I was watching Ring of Honor, I stopped before Dalton Castle was even like, because I know he ended up being like main event. He wasn't main event when I was watching. He, I stopped watching before he even started his feud with uh, Silas Young. I'm assuming like that's what really put him over the top. Because the only reason why I know it that he had a big feud with Silas Young is because I went to a Ring of Honor show after I had stopped watching and he was like in a pretty heavy feud with Silas Young. Like the boys came out with Silas Young, so I knew it was like a big feud. But I hate that. I really Dalton Castle. What is this? Like I don't get him. I don't like Joey Ryan either. Unpopular opinion. I don't understand why people like Joey Ryan. I like I like the boys. I like them more than I like Don Castle. And who don't like Adam Cole? Adam Cole is great. So is Don Castle's gimmick supposed to be like he's a new? When I see him, I think he's he he's gay, a New Orleans like. Oh, <laughs> I'm cold. What the heck? I'm cold is great. I just assume Don Castle's like a, a New Orleans. I don't know. I don't know. Just I just picture New Orleans when I see him with some those guys. Like I don't know. Yeah, he a New Orleans performer or a Vegas performer, and those are his. I don't know. Steve Carino used to be hilarious on Ring of Honor commentary when I used to watch. He was hilarious. What is going on? Side headlock applied by Adam Cole. Beautiful side headlock. But Dawn Castle always could wrestle. Always could wrestle. He could throw down. And I like his finisher. It's very contrived, but I like his finisher. He's on my game. He's on my universe. Adam Cole, baby. Oh yeah, he was known for them deadlift Germans. He has a good German suplex. But I don't need you to taunt after every move. I'm assuming Adam Cole wins this match, by the way. Swing and a miss. Man, Ring of Honor used to be that. Shit. Castle counters. This guy is in his own world. Oh, I like that move. Landon Peacock's own. Dalton Castle gets a two count. Can somebody explain to me what Dalton Castle character is supposed to be? Oh, wasn't he inside of a tag team with, with Cole Cabana? I, I didn't watch, never, don't know anything, but I just, I read or seen or something. Because I, I, I was so surprised when I saw uh, a little bit of a botch there. I remember seeing um, Cole Cabana return to Ring of Honor, and I was super surprised to see him in Ring of Honor. And he, I just feel like he feuded with Dalton Cosmo, or they was a team, or yeah, he was a team, and then feud. I don't know. Where's Cole Cabana now? I don't 
like him, but. Remember the kingdom. Adam Cole, Michael Bennett, and Maria Canellas and Matt Taven. By the way, I can't believe Matt Taven is the world champion of Ring of Honor. No, I couldn't believe Dalton Castle was the Ring of Honor world champion either. I don't watch it, but just hearing about that, I'm like what? Even Christopher Daniels, to be honest, and I love Christopher Daniels, but consider who on, was on their roster. Well, no, nah, because Christopher Daniels is a veteran, so. Christopher Daniels is good. I take that back. I, don't, I shouldn't have said his name. I was there when he was a world champion. I don't, remember, I don't know who he wanted from or anything like that, but I was there, and he came out with the world title in the middle of the show. Not the main event, but... He was super cool too. After the show, he was chilling, taking pictures. The heck is Steve Carino talking about? Pull his trunks down. What is wrong with Steve Carino? Oh, he used to be like a little crush on Adam Cole. For real. In case y'all don't know my history with oh not the boys. In case y'all don't know my uh, my history with Ring of Honor, I started watching. Oh, I went to a Ring of Honor show before I started watching Ring of Honor, uh, and I loved the show. It was probably the best wrestling show I ever been to. I'd only been to WWE shows at that point. It was just a whole different experience, and I just loved it. Started watching Ring of Honor right when. Kevin Steen had just lost the title, so Jay Briscoe was the champion. And I stopped watching. I don't remember when I stopped watching Ring of Honor. But I used to love it. I loved Ring of Honor when I watched it. Uh, I remember that Kevin Steen was like the top guy. He had just lost the title at the time. He was like the talk. Like, that's the name I heard a lot. And I remember thinking, like, why is he, like, so... Like, I was all about Michael Elgin. I was like, this guy is... I was a big Michael Elgin fan. Um, and I stopped watching. But then I, I, I learned to, I, you know, I liked Kevin Steen eventually. I always did. I just liked Michael Elgin more. Uh, Love the Briscoes. Uh, I stopped watching Ring of Honor, I think... I think I remember. I think I really stopped watching when when Jay Lethal won both titles, which is so unfortunate because Jay Lethal was great, and I wish I did see his his reign because I was a big House of Truth fan too. Truth Martini loved, wanted to go to his wrestling school out here in Detroit. Still, probably no, I still want to. Maybe if I had the time. Dang, Dalton Castle? Woo. There it is. Overhead throw out of the bear hug and almost. See how quickly the Dalton Castle transitioned from the suplex right into the new position. He's a strange duck, but a very talented duck. Oh, from the peacock. It can be many things in wrestling. It can be a moose. It can be a baby. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> what Steve Carino said. Ooh, I used to love that move. Well, still do. Ushi Garoshi. Oh, that's his finisher in WWE now, ain't it? I was say, apparently it was his finisher before he left Ring of Honor, too. His finisher from when I used to watch Ring of Honor was the Florida Keys. And sometimes he did the Panama Sunrise. The, the flip power. Doctor's 
Clemson told him at a minimum that he would probably be out. <laughs> I just thought about something. Funny story. So. That's at a minimum. Hold on. Adam Cole does the Panama Sunrise or whatever it's called where he jump off the second row on his feet and man does the flip the Canadian Destroyer, the flip pile driver, right? One time, he was about to do it off the second row or the first row, whatever row he picked. And he went higher, basically. And I'm like, what? what is the difference? All you're doing is going higher to land on your feet. Maybe it was in WWE. Like, he did it jumped off like he was on the second rope and he went higher like maybe to the top rope or maybe he was on a ladder or something like went higher like it was supposed to be like a bigger impact and i'm like you just did all that just so you can land on your feet and then do the move like it's kind of like when people do submissions on the table like or like one time kevin owens did a stunner on the table and i'm like what is going on remember when Paige used to do her submission on the table like, this so stuff does nothing. Oh, I remember this move. I like that. <laughs> and they real brothers. They like look like twins. Are they maybe? Yeah, they twins. They should be getting the bookings. I wonder what they doing nowadays. Because I remember going to, the, to Ring of Honor and they was like, they was great. Like, they was wrestling. They were like, they were with Silas Young. I wonder why was they having this match at Death Before Dishonor. By the way, this is Death Before Dishonor. You can tell this is 2015 because this looks like a regular TV taping. I'm glad Ring of Honor stepped their game up. Dang. I know what was going on there. Dangerous area there. Cole's got to get back in the ring. Former world champion. Adam Cole can quiet people like me who might be sowing the seeds of doubt of the kingdom with a win here. Cole just toying with Dolph Castle. Taking right a back. lot of time here. Maybe too much time. Castle <laughs> with the kick to the leg. The knee connects to the side of Adam Cole's head. Peacock to the top. Super kick. Cole. I remember they used to do that. Oh, regular German. Come on. Boom. So he was using that before he left. Bring him on. Okay. That doesn't 2015. Wouldn't I still been watching Ring of Honor? Did I really stop watching Ring of Honor? I only was watching. I wasn't watching Ring of Honor for that long. Now that I think about it, but it don't feel like I've been not watching for four years. For a long time. A cold super kick. He did have a lot of stuff in his arsenal. He had the figure four, Florida Keys, the Canadian Destroyer, because I don't know what that move is called. And apparently now he does the little Shining Wizard. I don't know what that's called either. And the super kick to the back of the head. So that's like five different moves that he could finish his opponent with. Cole is so good. But he met him. Boom. Bicycle kick staggers castle. So hot here, both men wearing down. Cole! Cole! Florida Keys. Nope. Uh, school boy. I thought Don Castle was about to win. Oh! That one dimmed the lights of Castle, no doubt. 
Here we go. Neckbreaker. Neckbreaker. Good night. One, two, three. I didn't know he finished people with that. That just took me by surprise. I thought for sure that was about to be a kick out. So that was kind of anticlimactic for me. My control, shuffle it around this deep, deep bone. All I ever really want, I never get it. Okay. I, I used to love Adam Cole's music, by the way. Loved it. My cousin used to love it, too. Like, we loved his music. But that's it for this video, y'all. That was good. That was good. That was good. That was good. Uh, volume 3. So, leave more comments inside the comment section down below for me to react to. For, for a match for me to react to inside Watch Wrestling With Me Volume 4. Share this video so, um, I don't know, so we can have more people to watch it with. But until next time, y'all, like, comment, subscribe, share. Catch you later.